When I was a child, I used to lay in bed late at night, staring at the ceiling, listening to my father scream. Scream at my mother, scream at yet another failed masterpiece. Finally, just scream out into the darkness. It became my lullaby. And even when they took me away, the screams followed. I was once told that insanity runs in my family. It's time to make it stop. in here. I swear that dog doesn't shut up! How the hell did you get out? Go on, get out of here! Before I find a way to keep you in there for good. Still life. <coughs> oh, this place is a mess. I can hear you in there. I'm coming, you furry little bastards. You're not getting away this time. What? Is that? Oh, yes! That's it! I wonder when was the last time this place saw sunlight?
What are you doing? Put that down! You're much too old for that childish nonsense! Creativity is not a toy! It's a gift! Do you want to squander it like all those careless brats out there? I warned you time and time again! I won't let you waste time in these mindless doodles! Finally! Are you ready to embrace true art? Oh, the summer trees. So green and vibrant and full of life. But also young and inexperienced. Let's try to find them in all poignant season. Where they are wiser and have some stories to tell. Ah, yes! The autumn of life, when man seeks shelter from the elements. Let's see how our little hut fares when the skies grow dark. You see? In the end, all we take for granted is fragile and temporary. Man passes while nature endures. Speaking of which, I don't think our proud stallion likes the weather. Let's brighten things up a bit. I warned you time and time again! I won't let you waste time in these mindless doodles! This is for your own good!
The little girl in red came upon a crossroads. There she stopped and wondered, which way should I go? Up jumped the wolf and gave the poor girl a fright. Do not be afraid, I'm not gonna bite. One of these paths with danger is fraught, while the other one, most assuredly, is not. The little girl in red took a shortcut she knew, through a lovely field of corn, all covered in dew. But the field grew dark and full of despair, and a eerie sense of dread filled the morning air. The girl heard the wolf yelling from afar, You have chosen poorly, you will not get far. Had you only learned how shadow and light intertwined on canvas, you could have chosen right. The little girl in red ran as fast as she could, her flowing dark hair tucked under her hood. But she quickly got tired, worn out by her flight, and succumbed to the darkness, never to see the light. Are you trying to annoy me? This is not what I've taught you. What? You think I'm enjoying this? You think I'm doing this out of spite? Get it right next time and I won't have to fix it for you!
Finally! Are you ready to embrace true art? You see? In the end, all we take for granted is fragile and temporary. Man passes while nature endures. Speaking of which, I don't think our proud stallion likes the weather. Let's brighten things up a bit. sun bestows its kind rays upon the land. It's getting warmer and warmer until finally. Marvelous, isn't it? I know it seems like a tragedy, but a beautiful tragedy is always better than an unremarkable existence. In his own way, I believe he meant well. He wanted me to excel, hoping that when the time came, I would succeed where he failed. Avoid his mistakes. God knows he made plenty of those. <laughs> 